If you're looking to build your team, make sure you head on over to CheapMaddenCoins.com for the cheapest prices, fast delivery, and 24-hour customer support. And make sure to use Cold Wolf for 10% off. Now, before we get into this video, I just want to let you guys know that I started posting blackout videos on my second channel. If you guys want to go subscribe there, check it out. I'll, put, I'll either put the link in the description or in the comments section. I don't know yet. Uh, when I get to that point, you guys will see it. But I do have a 5 KD, a 5.0 KD in blackout, and I'm already up to 73 wins. I just know how to win, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just comes natural to me when it comes to gaming. So make sure you go check out that if you don't mind. Now let's talk about the next play out of the Y off trips fat. Now I've shown you guys a few plays already. If you're new to the channel, man, make sure you check out the previous videos. I've been showing people different plays from within this set to create an evil scheme. Now today we're gonna talk about two plays. That's right, two plays. And the first one, if I can find it, is going to be called corners. Now people bring up in the comments that, you know, all oh, these are just cover three beating plays. And now I'm gonna show you a cover two beating play, two plays that you can use against cover two. So what we're doing is we're taking the same set, we're scheming out of it, and, and, and you're, you're guys, you guys are gonna be able to have just an awesome scheme just off this set. When I saw the set, I already knew. Like, man, this is the set. So the first play we're gonna talk about is the corners. And we're gonna go ahead and go against cover two. Now you can run it against cover three, it's the same thing. It's the same idea. You can still smoke cover three with these plays, but people want cover two beaters. So here we go, man. This is gonna be something for you guys right here. So the way we're gonna set this up is we're gonna streak Gordon. Put him on a streak, okay? Our outside, far, wide receiver, Gordon. Put him on a streak. And then we're gonna take Hollister, which should be Gronkowski, but he's like a point faster in his speed, so I put him in there just, just for the sake of the video. But I recommend you put your fastest tight end in the tight end spot of this set. Unless you're gonna run the ball a lot, then put your best run blocking tight end in there. You know what I'm saying? Does that make any sense to you guys? What we're gonna do with him is put him on a flat. Okay, so our play art looks like this. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna cancel the motion from our, uh, our running back by pass blocking him. We're gonna pass block that guy and then do whatever you want with X. Okay, you can bring him out, uh, put him on an in route, leave him where he's at. It doesn't matter, whatever you wanna do, but my reads are to the right of this screen. Now, being that the, uh, the defensive line is offset to the right and I'm looking to the right, I'm gonna slide protect to the right, okay? I wanna try to pick up that guy just in case I need, you know, I need to roll out right a little bit. Hopefully my offensive line uh, can grab that guy. But the read is simple. We're gonna look at the flat first. The way we're gonna read this flood concept is we're looking to the flat first, seeing what the corner does. He's gonna have to pick and choose. Does he wanna play his cloud or does he wanna play his flat? He has to pick one or the other. So whoever's open, A or RB, that's who we're gonna hit. As we snap this ball, we're going to see it's A, just like that, see? Now, you're not gonna get a lot of yards uh, unless they're playing hard flats, okay? So sometimes you will, sometimes you won't. It just depends on the situation, okay? So remember, B on a streak, A on a flat, RB, leave him the way he is. Uh, slide protect to the right, and here we go again. We're gonna snap the ball, boom. We'll get a little bit more yards. You see five or six yards because I waited a little bit lo uh, longer to see what that corner was going to do, and you can do that. As long as you have the time, you can do that. So remember, B on a streak, a on a flat, pass block the running back. Uh, you can put X on an in route as a bailout route just in case the user jumps your flood concept. Uh, then you can hit him over the middle of the field. And I'm gonna slide protect to the right, just like this. Now I'm going to look, look, he plays the hard flat. Boom, I got RB because he played the hard flat and I just get my head taken off, clean off my shoulders right there. So here we go again. Uh, B on a streak, A on a flat. We're gonna pass block our running back. Do whatever you want with X and then slide protect. It's that simple. These plays, I'm telling you guys, these plays are so easy, bro. Like, they're so easy to run. And, and right here, I'm getting four yards. But the idea of these schemes is to keep the chains moving. Give different looks to your opponent. You, you'll be able to you, just use this set and then just come at your opponent with all these different plays. He's not going to know what to expect. So I've already shown you guys a flood concept to the left. I'm showing you one to the right. I've showed you curl concepts. I've shown you a cover three beater right over the middle of the field. Uh, with another play so all these things you just blend in and I will provide gameplay once we're done with all the plays I'll go into a game and we'll just scheme this set so you guys can actually see it in action So one more time we'll do this against cover two then we'll move on to cover three And, and this is the setup that you want to do make sure you slide protect to the side you're going We're gonna watch that flat Boom, you see that? He, he played the flat and I have the RB route open. So that corner has to pick and choose who he wants to cover. Now let's talk about this against cover three. Like I said, you can still run these plays against cover three. The, the reads are going to be the same if I can find it. Corners and we'll do cover three, we'll do random cover three. Same thing. 
The only play on defense that'll give you problems is like cover three Mabel. But if you're running other plays uh, instead of just spamming the same one, then you should be all right. You should, probably won't even see Mabel. I haven't even seen Mabel uh, this year. So right here, you'll see it's still the same reads. If anything, it, it's gonna get open the same as, as cover two. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's the same reads. Very hard to stop a flood concept unless you know what you're really doing. As you can see that our flat route is still open. So take the routes as they come. If they give you the flat, then just take the flat route. You know what I'm saying? It's all about uh, uh, just consistency. This is why I end up with 85 to 90% completion percentage in the games that I win because I'm not trying to throw bombs all the time, bro. I'm not trying to be the hero. So here we go again. Nobody there in the flat. Boom. Get my yards. It's easy. It's simple. I'm waiting for them to actually play right here. I don't even know what they're going to do. Right here, if you come across someone like that, just run the ball on them. You know what I mean? Just run halfback power. Just run it. You know what I mean? Just, just boom. It, it, it's, you know, like who's going to run three deep anyway? You better win that game if someone's just running three deep on you. Okay. Streak the B route. Flat the A route. Slide protect to the right because I need to pick up what he was supposed to do. Uh, and then the read is simple. Here we go. It's either A. There it is right there. You see? Boom. RB because he dropped down to the hard flats to pick up that flat route by the tight end. So there's that play right there. Now let's talk about the same kind of play. Takes a little bit longer to develop. Okay, I'm not going to lie to you guys. If I can find it. It's called the double unders. This is going to be ran by a tight end. This is why I tell you guys you need your fastest tight end in that position. Double unders. We're going to run it against cover two. Random cover two. And what we're going to do is the same setup. But this time... We're going to put RB on the flat, B on the streak, and leave the tight end the way he is. Pass block the running back, slide protect to the right. Now, like I said, this play does take a little bit longer to develop, but it can gain you a lot of yards if the read is right. So here we go. No one stays in the flat. I'm going to go ahead and just hit the flat. Like I said, take, take the open routes that they give you. Don't be the hero. Uh, just run it the way I'm telling you guys. So double unders and corners are two plays that you want to use a lot against cover two defenses. I'm going to slide protect to the right. ID the mic on whoever you think is going to blitz. And then we're looking at RB and then we're looking at A. Let's see what they do. No one stays in the flat. This guy's wide open. You'll see that the space for this guy is a little bit more open. But they do break down to him pretty fast. So it's not like one of those the greatest plays, right? But it's consistent plays. And that's what you need to implement into your schemes is consistency. So no one stays with him again, then we're just going to hit him again and get five yards every time that we get we, we catch the ball. You know what I'm saying? So what we're doing is we're actually waiting for them to play a hard flat. Let's see them play a hard flat. Let's see them real quick. Here we go. This is this is what I was looking for. Just like that. OK, now that zone is not going to jump back and pick up that route. It's just not going to happen. He doesn't jump back there. There's no special formula for the for that the, that hook zone or whatever yellow is going to play that. OK, the only thing that could probably pick that up, not even a, a, a wreck will pick that up. Uh, it would just have to be like someone manned up. Not even a purple will pick that up. I'll tell you guys right now, not even a purple will pick that route up. That's how confident I didn't slide protect to the right. That's my fault. So as we, we get our four or five yards for consistency, that, that's all I'm worried about. I'm not trying to be the hero. Um, I actually don't know what they would run right here. Yeah, so it'd be flat routes all day. All day. If they're giving you flat routes, you take flat routes. You know, once you force them to start picking up the flat routes, then you're going to start hitting them uh, uh, down the field. Slide protect to the right. Here we go. See what we got. We got nobody in the flat again. They're not really playing hard flats in this one right here. So, like I said, I want to try to hit this tight end again one more time before we actually end the video. Because remember, the reads are going to be the same as the as the corners play. It's the same thing. Just make sure you're canceling the the the, the motion by your running back. That way, you have extra protection. You know what I'm saying? And what I'm doing here we go. Here we go. That's that's the one I'm looking for right there. So when they play hard flats, you make them pay with that route right there. Now, against cover three, it's the same way. I'll show it to you guys one time, uh, and then we'll break this video so you guys can start using it, start practicing it. Uh, it's double unders. So remember, the two plays we're talking about is corners and double unders. And we're going to come over here to cover three and just run random cover three. Same setups. Same reads, okay? Same reads. What are they doing? They're playing hard flats. Tied in all day. This guy's faster than that guy, so I don't have to worry about it. But remember, these guys aren't that fast already. You know what I'm saying? So there it is, man. I hope you guys appreciate the video. 
make sure you drop a like go check out my other channel my second channel man i'm posting blackout gameplay uh i might do some red dead it, it just depends but i'm going to be posting different games over there but most consistently are probably going to be blackout trying to get to those hundred wins already check you guys out in the next video man peace